Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich. Welcome back to Let's Play Assassin's Creed 2. Um, okay, so we can actually replay this dungeon, we just can't enter it this way. So, the way we would have to enter it, and I want to check something really quick, because this is going to be a good proof of concept of whether or not we even need to do this. So we go all the way up here. 199 of 330 treasures. Okay. Secret locations. And we can replay this memory. So we actually are... We are... Accessing it directly from the Animus. Which makes sense. We can just jump around in uh, our own memories, and well, in Ezio's memories. You can actually get this without getting this, this hidden skill I was talking about. Or this skill I was talking about. Di Grazia, stay away from the artwork on the walls. And when your men paint the dome, take care not to disturb any of the sacred relics in the Lanterna on top. They are the most important artifacts in our church. Yes, yes, Padre. Just make sure to pay us the full sum for our work. Okay. So let's see if our jump ability helps us kind of skip ahead in this. Probably not, though, because it doesn't really help us jump higher off the ground. Yeah, until we can grab onto a place. Yeah, like we can't grab on there, so we can't. We can't get up higher. Oh, I'm sure there's a good skip for this, but... Not the right move. Good not the right move, though, man. Okay, so this is going to take a while. I shouldn't even play this. I mean, not on camera. I guess I should just go into story time or something. But I can't really think of a story. I should tell you guys about my toolbox for work, because I just got a job at work that requires me to bring in a toolbox, and I can decorate my toolbox however I want, so I gave it, as long as it's not obscene, those were the rules, as, as I was told, I was, I was told that there were rules, and that the rules were that it can't be anything obscene, 
so uh, my toolbox has posable arms and now and I eyes back up in case I fall. and uh, sharp pointy teeth. Okay, Enzio, what do you got? So let's see what we have for other what what other kind of stories. Eh. Man, I do not like doing this. I really don't. Oh, oh, did I say that did I say that apparently you can't you can't change a target once it's locked on? I, at least according to game facts. Which is ridiculous. It's a ridiculous uh programming flaw in this game, frankly. It really seems like that's the kind of thing that would have been, that was settled by the production of, like, GTA games. So I'm not coming up with any stories. So there's the place I wanted to get to, though. All of that just to get over here. If we had just like taken some of these pews and slid them around, we'd be fine. Okay, this is clearly not it. Alright. Well, my confidence level is a little higher anyway. Okay, well that's our checkpoint then. This seems like a thing we've already done. This seems like a thing we have to do. Isn't this is a thing we have to do. And there's no hidden area here. I'm going to be relieved if these don't... If these aren't required, but... My feeling is that they probably are. So 
So this is it. There's one back there. And I think what I decided was I could go this way. And then what I needed to do... Was that. But that doesn't work. So apparently what you have to do is get up here and do this and then we can do that. So now, after only 12 minutes, we can tell if these secret locations are required. So let's check. Huh, I can't access... No? Not at all? Get back up there. Wow, I'm gonna have to start over. That's painful. I could exit the replay, but I don't know how that affects. Well, it is a replay, so... Let's see what exiting the replay does. Nope. Okay, because current memory progress will be lost. We don't want to do that. At all. We just want to finish this garbage. So it is going to take like a video to replay the secret. And that's a pain. And there's another treasure chest in here. Wow, that was weird. He would move. All right, back up we go. So it's been raining really hard here lately. Like super hard. 
And uh, so hard, actually, that my niece had to take a, uh, a kayak to her house yesterday. True story. Like, I think they're trying to get uh, this place declared a disaster area. And it rained really hard again today. It was really bad. No! Well, I desynced, which will checkpoint me up top. Yep, checkpoints me right here. So yeah, it's it's been nuts. It's been absolutely and totally nuts. The, just the amount of water. There's like entire cities that I mean they're 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 villages. There there are these entire villages in Wisconsin that are that are not going to exist anymore. Because of the amount of water. Like, places where water is up to the bottom of people's roofs and stuff. It's just nuts. It's just absolutely nuts. Okay, I don't see any indication that that treasure chest still exists. Enzio, I really hate your reaction to ladders. Okay, so then there should also be one on a balcony. It's probably over there. But I don't see it. Maybe we got that one. Nope, it's down there. Okay, that should be both of them. Unfortunately... Wow, that, that didn't take me down a long way or anything. So those are the two secrets in here. Every every crypt has two. So at least we get that right. Alright. So this is going to take more than 20 minutes. We could have done both of these when we were here before. It wouldn't have been a huge deal. There are not a lot of things about this that I like. These platforming puzzles are so long. I 
330 treasure chests in the game. So we had 199 before this. Right? Yeah, vertical sandwich, 199! Yeah, see, 199. Okay, we go around this ladder, not up it. Okay. We're almost there. Whoa, okay. Didn't want to do that. I mean, it worked, but I didn't want to do it. Okay. Right. Changes so I can do that. Okay, well that got us out. Do we have to re-get the seal? That that seems weird. Okay, and are there other treasure chests here? No, those treasure chests count as having been gotten. So, we've synced this now. And it sh that should work out to, like, once we come out, we should be back in regular uh, NZO free, like, free play. And we should be able to check our DNA and see what's going on as far as that goes. And see if we need these treasure chests. And if we don't, then we don't. We don't need them. Like, they don't count. So, that's a relief when we come back more of this. Bye, everybody.